Hello! In this video I will show you how is possible basic SQL query to convert into the XML string. For the beginning we create a temporary table and uh, fill in the table with the values, just for example. Then you need to make a query to the database and at the end of the query you need to enter the magic command for XML pass. In the brackets you can indicate the root node of your XML. As well in the query you can find interesting command row number. This command return sequential number of our records. As well, in the query you can find that uh, some column names are very weird. Why it's so? Because those four columns we separated in the specific child node product. And in this, in, and in this child node product we have a four subnodes product name quantity price and amount now let's execute the script and take a look on the result so we got an xml string and let's put it uh, next to the data in order to compare the result so the root node is my orders it's exactly as we defined over here then we have a three nodes, record number, order date, and person's ID. It's the first three columns from our query. Then we have a child node product with four subnodes, product name, quantity, price, and amount. It's exactly as we defined in our query and as we see the data as we have in our insert commands. I hope you find it useful. Take care. Bye.